as a growing chorus of anger and frustration was on display near a facility that's housing undocumented children taken from their families. Homeland Security confirmed this weekend that it has separated at least 2,000 children from parents at the border since implementing this practice. Now, a number of people back up here joining in protests, hundreds of them marching outside the U.S. ICE building in southwest Portland. Jennifer Dowling joining us with the story. Jennifer? That's right, Trevor. This was called Father's Day on Ice, this protest, and there are around 200 people here in Portland taking to the streets. A lot of parents during the protest said this policy is criminalizing those who are just looking for a better life and traumatizing children. Say it loud, say it clear. Immigrants are welcome here. Protesters chanted in front of the U.S. Immigration Customs Enforcement Office in southwest Portland today, calling for the government to stop tearing families apart. Well, we're protesting the separation of families at the border. Mary Welsh says she usually doesn't participate in protests, but this moved her to action. This isn't my ammo very much, but for this, I just, it's just breaking my heart. Protesters hope this pressures the Trump administration to change its zero tolerance policy or prompts lawmakers to step in. On a day like today, Father's Day, uh, I'm proud to be a father. I have the privilege of being able to have my family with me, being able to celebrate and have that moment with my family. Pedro Anglada says the celebration of dads this weekend has made this fight even more urgent. And, and knowing that, that other fam the families are being separated, being put in, in detention centers, this is heartbreaking and it's insulting, it's disgusting. He says many in the immigrant community are afraid to speak out for fear of retaliation, so others must be their voice. All Americans have to come in solidarity for the community that is hurting, and they have to show up and use the privilege to speak out for those who may feel fearful about speaking out. Immigrants are welcome here. 